everyone, Eli here on Eli G Productions. Well, right now, you may have noticed I'm not using um, these crappy earphones right now. I finally figured out what my laptop is doing. So right now, I'm using my laptop, which is why it's crappy like this. This is very crappy. I need better, I need better camera. Yes, very better camera. Alright, so, I know I said that you guys might have until Sunday night to get your questions in, but we have a lot on- <coughs> I have a lot of questions already, so, like, I'm gonna, like, just divide them up, like, some of the questions are gonna go into this video, and some of the other questions are gonna go into the next. That way, it's not, like, a very stretched out, uh, video, because, like, I do know that people go for the longer videos nowadays, for some reason, like, it used to be the shorter ones. Because, like, you know, people have short attention spans. I know I do, and... But... <laughs> anyway. Uh, so, yeah. Uh, okay. So, I did get a lot of anonymous ones, sadly. Like, I... I don't mean to say that it's bad that you guys want to be anonymous. But, like, I just... So many questions are really good that, like, you should take responsibility for them. And I like that. Like, the credit. But, um, I'm not gonna judge you. Either way, I get questions, so I'm happy about that. Yay! Because we could do another one of these! Even though I don't even remember what number we're on. What number are we on? You don't know either? There's no one there. <laughs> um, anyways, where's my phone? I lost my phone! Oh, there it is. Hey, yeah, see, more questions. No more questions. So let's get this thing on the go. Alright, so we're gonna start with Zenny Boos. You guys remember her, right? Yeah, and if you do, awesome. And if you don't, I'm gonna have a link in the description for her channel. Therefore, you can go check her channel out. I know her from Wattpad because she writes all my stories all the time, she comments on them, and she loves my Mori ones. Yay! I technically would have to say she's the reason why uh, I'm popular on Wattpad, because she's the one that always makes my Mori stories seem like they're so popular. Which, by the way, thank you for. Anyways, so... Let's get started. Is any booze or sh question? How was your Thanksgiving? My Thanksgiving? That is an old question already. I'm sorry, did not answer that right away. Hmm. Anyways, my Thanksgiving was great. There was food, we went shopping, we got stuff, it was great. I hung out with my sister and my mom, we were we were having fun and everything. My my Thanksgiving was really great. Hope yours was too. So I'm just gonna ask, how was yours? The next question. How was college? <laughs> Stressful. My advice. Um, do really good in high school. Make sure that you're noticed. You get more scholarships that way. And go to a two-year college first. Go to a two-year college first. Get your generals out of the way. You can get your associate's degree and figure out if college really is for you or not. And if it, it isn't for you, you have two years of college experience and a uh, an associate's degree, that way you can, like, get a good job. So, either way, got your generals out of the way, you got a degree, good for you. That's what I'm going for right now, I'm just testing out the waters. Anyways, but it's very stressful. It, like, I thought I had more space in between the classes, and I do, but it's just, like, assignment after assignment after assignment, and then, with work, yeah, it's like, Argh. Anyways. Where do you work? Um, I work at a barbecue restaurant called Smokin' Bees. It's, uh, it's a Sock Rapids restaurant. It used to be in Albany, Minnesota, but now it's in Sock Rapids, Minnesota. And I am a waiter slash waitress, uh, cashier, and morning prep. I guess you can say morning prep. I don't know, but, um, how is it? How is work? That's her next question. <laughs> it's my very first job. 
official job, I should say. And, um, it's really hard. I keep screwing up. Um, I don't know, I just don't like being in a wait. Like, I know, I now know the issues that waitresses and waiters have, so now I try to be as nice as I can to them. Like, I now tip. I start tipping now. And I make sure that it's, like, easier for them to have to clean the tables, like, because, like, I know from um, experience and how, like, wow. And, oh, I, just, I like the people there, and I sometimes like my work. But lately, all I just want to do is just focus on my schoolwork and sleep. That's all I want to do. Anyways, next, 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 next. Can you bathe a hamster? No. Yes. Yes and no. See, with a hamster, it's a it's a little different. You can't put them in like warm soapy water or like in a little sink and wash them with your hands. No, no. Um, you use a critter bath powder. You get a box and splash bag of the this at a uh, pet smart chain. And uh, you get that, and then you gotta get a little bathhouse, which is one of these. It can be cute. Very much so. And um, you fill it. And it's like the powder, as you can, I think you can see it. And um, you put it in the cage, so like here's the bottom of the cage. Here's this. Just put it there. And then like go crawl right in, and then you can put a timer for 10 minutes, and then uh, let them roll around in there for 10 minutes. And then once 10 minutes is up, you you remove the bathhouse from the cage because they can only go in there for 10 minutes because otherwise it would like the powder is all soiled and things like that. And then what's the point of putting that in there? They're just gonna get uh, all messy again. Plus the crap and piss in there, so we don't need that. How do you feel about Thomas Gibson getting fired from Criminal Minds for kicking a writer? I heard it was punch. Like, I thought somebody actually, like, said that he punched the writer. Hmm. Oh, well, I, I think it's kind of weird. I never thought that he would actually do something like that. Because, you know, he seemed really funny whenever they showed, like, the bloopers on the YouTube channel. And he seemed like a really chill dude. He seemed really funny. And then when I heard about that, I'm like, what the hell? What happened? Why? Don't leave. Don't fire him. Like, are they gonna try to get somebody else to be hot? They're trying to get somebody else to be hot. It's like, fuck no. But, yeah. So there are her questions. The anonymous ones. Okay. What about my hamster? One person asks, how old is your hamster? Um, I don't know. I want to say a year. I want to say she's a year old, maybe younger. I don't know. I don't know how old she is. My, mo my mother never mentioned that. Now, now I'll go ask her when, when she comes back. But, um... Nope. Don't know how old she is. What's your hamster's name again? Sakura. Like, the cherry blossom. Or as some of you anime fans would like to say, like, Sakura Haru now. Um, the one. What kind of hamster is she? Why does everybody like my hamster? Or want to know about my hamster? This is the Q&A about me. I'm kidding. I'm not that selfish. Anyways. Um, she's a white Russian. White winter Russian. So... Eat a little bitch. Yep. <laughs> um, okay. Are you and your boyfriend still together? That's a different question. 
Um, yeah, my boyfriend and I are still together. Um, I mean, I need space. So I've asked him for space lately. So we haven't really talked all that much. And when we do, he catches me at the wrong time. So it's like, I'm kind of already stressed out. Or, or I just want some peace and quiet. Or I just want it to just be him and I. Like, not him and I, but like, me and myself coming kind of thing. Or like, I want to go hang out with other friends kind of thing. So... Yeah, we're, we're together. It's just, I just don't have the ring on right now because it turned my finger green. Actually, I shouldn't really say the reason because I shouldn't really say it because I'm um, like Never mind. <laughs> um, anyway. Totally different story. Another question when will you be doing some gamer videos again? Okay, yeah. I think I've mentioned this one before. I'm trying to get back into the gaming the gaming stuff. But um recently my recording system is kinda like <laughs> So I need to actually do that. I need to get better stuff for that. And because I actually do want to record some of the stuff. And, um, I've been playing lately because it's, like, really fun. Like, I even bought Outlast, and I'm like, yeah, I know Outlast is, like, a dead thing now, but, like, I love watching some people play it and then, like, hearing or watching their reactions to it, and I wished one time I was recording when I was playing it because, like, I forgot about one part, and I nearly flipped my laptop onto the floor when I was sitting on my bed. That is that way. And, uh, I almost went... <coughs> And that would have been really bad, but it was really funny, because I forgot about this one part. And yeah, <laughs> she was recording. Yep. Another question, so when is Trace coming back onto the show? Trace was actually here not too long ago. He actually came back on Thanksgiving, we hung out Friday. Um, he didn't record anything, so, you know, it was, you were just... To hang out and everything. Um, 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 I'm thinking maybe to go up there during Christmas break, like up to Duluth for Christmas break, because we have some friends coming in from a different state or country, and uh, they're gonna come visit for a while. And the friends from the different country, they live in Australia. They're from here. They're from the U.S., but they moved to Australia. And, um, they're gonna come back and visit for a bit, um, let their kid, their, I think he's two years old now. He's like, my he's basically my nephew because my friend is basically a younger brother to me. Um, so they're gonna come back, uh, let, um, my nephew see what snow really is. And, um, yep. We're gonna, they're gonna drive up to Duluth, go see Trace. Go see another friend, so I'm just thinking like maybe go up with him to Duluth to go see Trace, give him his present, save some money on sending the stuff to him, <laughs> and um, oh, and uh, I have another friend who you guys probably don't remember, probably at the same time he moved to Texas. Like we hadn't talked, I think for a whole year maybe. Um. I'm just gonna say his name. Sorry, dude. Um, Callan, if you guys remember who Callan is from previous, previous videos, um, we're talking again. Like, we're not all fist buds or whatever, like, oh, hey, bro, what up, man? It's more like, hey, how you doing? Hey, what's up? You gonna, gonna come visit sometime? I kind of thing. It's like, hey, how, what's been going on? You know, we started talking again and everything, so. Um, he might come back up from Texas to come visit, and if he does, um, it's only going to be a short time, because I don't, I don't know. I don't know, I, I might talk to my boyfriend about going in to do this for the next weekend, for the whole entire break, because if we're there for the whole entire break, um, I don't have to work. <laughs> that was bad to say. 
I don't know when he's gonna be back on the show because he lives all the way in Duluth. I live here in South Rapids. And I wanna go live in Duluth, to be honest. I want to actually move to Duluth. I really do. I, I love it. The last time I was up there, I fell in love with it. And I just wanna move there. It's like Anchorage and New York mixed in one. I think, guess what? Well, I'll see what my New Yorker friend thinks. Um, the one that he, um, the friends that are coming from Australia, one's from here, from Minnesota. The other one is from New York. They moved, they both moved to Florida. Then they moved to Australia. Now they're coming back. Back to. Yep. I don't know. I don't know when he's going to be back. Uh, last question. We're going to go with the last question because I'm already, um, this video already went from longer than I wanted it to, and i am been babbling on for the past few times, and all you guys want to hear is answers, not me babbling on and shit like that. <clears throat> Anyways. If you died and was reincarnated as an animal, what animal would you be and why? I think a wolf. I think I would get reincarnated as a wolf. I think I would like to actually be a wolf, because you know I'm Cherokee and I'm from the wolf part of the tribe and so yeah I think wolf I would actually like to be a wolf I like wolves I consider myself a hybrid because I both because I like vampires and werewolves so it's like hey hmm and wolves are so I don't know all of my friends used to call me the, like um they used to I think they were messing around trying to boost my ego or something but they used to say I was like the alpha of the group I highly doubt that now since I'm in college, because, like, I don't know. Is there really that much of a bitch? Damn. Huh. Well, anyways. Now that I think I would actually like to be a wolf. Or a fox. Oh, sneaky fox. Huh. Anyways. Yep. So. This is the Q&A of the day. Uh, I got so many questions that I gotta put into the next one, but I've already dragged this one on, and I really honestly don't know what I'm doing half the time, because I'm just babbling on and blah 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 blah. You guys came here for answers, not for me to babble on about random things that basically make no sense. Imagine what I'll have to do to edit this thing. It's going to take forever. This may be really late. So this is like a late video. I am very, 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 very sorry. Very sorry. That sounded bad. Very racist. Way to go, Eli. Way to go. Anyways, so better just sign up and put it on. I just drag, like, stretch this thing out. So much more fun to do this thing with a friend. I think next time I'll have a friend do it with me. Yeah. No promises. Anyways, well this has been Eli on Eli G Productions. Laters.